know, you don't have to like learn how to fight against KJH and then you get gapped once you finally hit that person right. in a major that's that good. But I think online being able to get the consistent practice all the time um, is paid such dividends to some of these characters that have I don't, a little bit more of like a definitive path sure. for a player people to play against. Like we're talking about, they're a little more exploitable in certain scenarios. Yeah. Um, okay, so here it's going to be important. I think we're going to try to open him up, yeah, with that nair. That nair at that certain like angle is, is pretty hard for Fox to crouch cancel, surprisingly. So if you do come down on like a 45 with Pikachu or with uh, Jigglypuff, it's actually really hard for Fox to crouch cancel. But yeah, and I already noticed that Den on those, he, they, he, you see it again here, they're going to lose his stock for okay, it. Okay, that's going to be really but. important. We have to see if Fox misses his tech his tech windows, right? If he misses his tech windows, he's going to get up air arrested, right? But if he hits the tech off the first up air, he's going to be okay. Yeah. The nares that Den is throwing out, they're trying to get, like, right in front on top of Puff, and they're doing a very quick fastball. Gotcha. They're, like, very intentionally doing these extremely fast, like, they're kind of um, stopping their momentum before they would get like the full oh, length nair. Oh, that's a great point. They're kind yeah. of doing it and then just instant fast falling down. Yeah. Okay, nice. Holding down, doesn't get knocked off the stage. Oh, I love that. And this is gonna be the fight for center stage, right? Yeah. Whoever has center has pretty much the thing. And then see, that's the problem is when, when Puff has to go into center, it's a little rough for Puff, right? Because Fox can just call it out really easily. Yeah. When. Puff has to float towards you, much, much less advantageous than for the Puff than when you have to approach them. Yeah. Um, I will say that uh, if if they're willing, you know, to slow down and find their opening to get back into it. Oh, like you said, if can they di up throw rest? They answered that question for you. They did. Oh. Wow. Yeah, I like that. that was a. I like Puff F Smash. Yeah, it's really good. It's always important to tech away from Puff too. Puff isn't the fastest character, so teching in place gives Puff an, an ability, a chance to, to punish it, right? But if you tech away, Puff's not gonna really reach you in time. So, a um, couple times. That back air was meaty. It felt way meatier than <laughs> any other Puff bear. I don't know yeah. why. I heard the bass in my headphones. Right. Panko a head shaker. There's one in chat if you're a head shaker. Ooh, drill. He tried to read the Smash DI with the up tilt. He's able to shield in time. This is a great match so far. Oh, getting off the oh. ledge. We're getting closer and closer to that up throw, up air percent. Depending on DI, it, it, it'll kill now, depending on DI. Yeah, Which. Magic 69. <laughs> Okay, so right here it's a little it's a little risky because Puff is not comboable over here, I think. So I think jab up smash, jab back air now. It depends on like what part of the stage yeah. puffs happen. Oh, oh that missed attack, that's huge. He that, recovers. Oh, and there this maybe one last chance here. Oh, yeah, nice that job. one's done. And Panko holds it out. Yeah. It's a scary spot for both players. It is, yeah. It's really easy for Fox to miss text when he's like um, inputting something else, right? So when anytime Jigglypuff hits you with like a soft hit or you're not ready to tech it, that's that's like money for Jigglypuff. Yeah. Um, and that Nair is like floats for so long and yeah. kind of slow and the way they fade it, you're not necessarily always sure when you're gonna get hit. And you might yeah. even lock yourself out of a tech by like thinking, I'm gonna exactly. get teched. I mean, I'm gonna get hit, I'm teching, and then now you're locked down, you get hit right after. Right, same same deal with Puff's, Puff's up air, right? Puff can really delay it and ma hit, make it hit with different parts of the up air to make you miss the tech, so. Or if you're me, I would have just got rested immediately after the nair. <laughs> <There you laughs> yeah. So, Den doing a little bit better in that regard. Yeah. But Panko taking game one, Pokemon Stadium. Oh, yeah. this is such a dominant stage for Fox in general. Yeah, it really is. So he's got the percent lead. Up there, up air, definitely kills now. And a lot of times, honestly, like I feel like Den should not be swinging with some of these moves as, he's, he's as much right now. He's definitely going in, right? Yeah, it depends like what your, what style you kind of want to play in this matchup, because sometimes you'll want to keep Puff at a more specific percent so that you can hit these up throw uppers. But now that you've hit Puff to like 100, now you have to get him to like 120 or get a stray up smash. That's a great but point. if you keep him at that like 65 to 70 a little bit more, um, I think a lot of times it can be better. That's when you should start looking for your finishers, either up throw up air, jab up smash. Like you start, that'll kill on this stage too at 70. Yeah. You put them at 100 and then now you just like, you get a nair and they just float away and you have to reset neutral. That's a great point, yeah. Oh, not able to cover that. 
Oh, wow. The so uptilt. these drills, uh, they could be getting grabbed here. Yeah, the, the turnaround up tilt after the drill is interesting, too. But and he's just trying to build as much percent as he can with these lasers. There it is. Beautiful. Took his time. Kind of went in with the shield first to see if he attacked. Once he did see he didn't, he went in with the jab up smash. Yeah, and those lasers were kind of putting almost a uh, little bit of a timer on Panko, like how much damage do I want to take here? And eventually they kind of start floating forward and then just run in jab up smash. And oh, he did get to ledge. Yeah, I love this. Okay, Fox at zero. I wonder how Panko's going to play around the 0% Fox with the stock lead. It's really important here. <laughs> Is that the flutter kick? Or? Oh, gets it. Did not DI that one. They did DI it oh, after. Sure. They didn't DI the up throw. They yeah, DI that's the a rest. tough spot there. Sometimes you don't know if you're going to live if you DI up, or do you want to DI down and take the punish, take the kill so you can come back and punish yeah. the sleeping well, uh, Jigglypuff. So good awareness to DI that really well. Yeah, I feel like that was nearly perfect DI too, because I'm really surprised they yeah. lived there. That wasn't like at zero. I think there were 42 after the Oh, beautiful read. Go. Wow. Oh, yeah, he's waiting. Panko heating up. Does not get the tech chase. That would have been huge there. Puff is still at this percent where you won't get the kill, but now now if you rest, you will get nice. stock traded. Oh, beautiful. Rest starting to get off the table unless you want to bank on a star KO, but doesn't even get the opportunity <laughs> to stock. You saw the head shake from Panko. It's so yeah. funny. Like, sometimes you think, like, why would you just run up and up smash? Like, why? Shake it like a salt shake it. There we go. Oh, the Brockhampton pants. Let's go, Den. Oh, that pound at low percent wow. is so hard to tech. Yeah. And you're getting nothing oh, for that. Get anything off that. Oh, there we go. See, he's taking a place here, right? Taking a place against Jigglypuff is very risky. Taking a place and no miss tech. And miss tech is pretty much Jigglypuff's like. Really big openers. You're so focused on not missing your tech and just getting it that you forget that you need to tech a specific way. Yeah. Oops. Silk. Yeah. Smooth. Paco's definitely like he's way more comfortable getting rest on this stage too because you wouldn't you're not gonna die from a rest punish as easily on this stage as you would other stages. Man, it's been a while since I've seen two name tags in a single game. Yeah. We're slippy, we uh, we forget sometimes. Who's do you like more? Do you like oops or do you like silk? I like silk. Silk makes silk like really smooth. I like silk too, I like but I think oops looks. on a Jigglypuff is very funny. That's true. That is very <laughs> funny. Lasers. Yeah. Let's see how Den try to rack up percent once again, taking in place. Actually and kill, not oh. quite. I think that th I think that would be a guaranteed kill around like 72%. 100%. I think there's like a I think there's yeah. an old like post by Mewtwo King called like the magic of 72% versus Puff or something. Somehow that's like kind of the kind of what I was talking about earlier, a percent that you can stay right. around because you're open to some of these more efficient kill confirms. Yeah, he's now he's at 123. He's gonna play pretty safe here. It's kind of like a weird form of Marthritis, especially on a stage like this. Okay. There. Oh, got a shark in. I like the holding down there. He just didn't side B right away. Ooh, that was an interesting. What a tech! Wow, that was an amazing tech. And it was a good edge guard too from Panko. But better recovery from Den. However, Panko finding it. Stock lead now. One apiece. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, I like that. Again, just the regular get up, no roll or anything. Yeah. All right. So Panko, keeping the lead again. Yeah, definitely pretty impressive. He really played off like Den's kind of, he went, Den was, you can tell Den really was like being really aggressive, wanted to go in a lot, you know? And uh, that's great, but you also have to, Think about the quality of the hits versus uh, Jigglypuff. Yeah. Um, straight hits don't necessarily aren't that great unless you're really good at scrapping and you're able to like pick it up. But it, it's also very risky too because sometimes you just get grabbed out of your move. Yeah. Yoshi's story though, for seeing that Den is willing to go for some of these straight hits and stuff, Yoshi's story definitely will help benefit that a yeah. lot. Like your back airs actually will kill. Oh early. my gosh. Or up smash just kills at 55%. Yeah. Because it does.
This is huge. Oh, was really late on that punish. Just watched him for a second. Literally, just do anything other than that. <laughs> Sorry. It's, with the up throw up air, it's it won't kill at that percent. Like even with the time you had to laser, it can be SDI'd like it was. Just if you want to do that, just charge up smash, get more percent. Okay. Pretty even. Oops. I like these lasers. He's weaving them in. He can. Oh my goodness, that was so good from yeah. Panko going between those platforms and. Oh, oh my wow, god! Wow, that is the. Problem with Yoshi's story sometimes that bottom is so low you'll go deep for a recovery and you'll just end up dying Or if you're a fox or something you'll try Firefox instead of dying yeah. And yeah, this stage you have to remember that bottom is it's very short yeah. No oh, deep sea diving here I was atrocious. Oh nice trade on the up tilt. I like that if, I think if uh, Den trying to place a little more patient in center and waits for Jigglypuff to come in He will be able to get those kills Oh, oh wow. my god! And just knows, do not jump there for that one at that percent. Just immediate rest. That yeah. was perfect. And Panko has brought this back now after that unfortunate SD. Oh, beautiful. Wow, you live in. Oh. That was a scary forward air. Yeah. Oh, Den's, Den's wanting just a little too much right now. Yeah. Just slow it down. Fiction oh. said in Last Talk scenarios, if you ever get nervous. Oh! oh my goodness, and they find it. Panko with the 3 1. Clutches up. Wow. And in the wise words of fiction, if you're on a last stock scenario, I would rather lose by doing too few moves than doing too many. Mm. So if you're getting in those situations, you're starting to feel a little nervous, slow it down, use your movement, look for your opening, don't get too antsy. And Panko, that's what they did, and they found their opening and they took it. Yeah, that was such a good reaction.